In our Health Watch report, Local 3's Connie Feldman introduces us to a teen with an innovative mind to fight tooth decay. Here's a question we've pondered for decades. How many licks does it take to get to the center of a Tootsie Pop? Scientists have actually come up with the answer. It takes 2,500 licks, but with each lick comes the risk of cavities. Tooth decay is actually the most common chronic childhood disease. Candy and soda are two big culprits, but now one teenage CEO has a company that's combating that. My dad always told me, you know, you shouldn't have candy, sugar is terrible for your teeth. But Alina Morse wasn't going to accept it. So I asked him, you know, why can't we make a healthy candy? And that is how Zollipop was born, a lollipop that cleans your teeth. Its inventor, the youngest CEO ever to grace the cover of Entrepreneur Magazine, the idea came to Alina at seven. She cooked up concoctions, asked her dentist questions, and had friends sample them. Zollipops use a low-calorie sweetener called erythritol. It reduces the acid in your mouth that causes bacteria, which can break down enamel. She used $4,000 she saved from past birthdays. Her dad matched it, and together they found a production facility and distributor. By nine years old, she got her first yes. 18 months later, she turned a profit. Now, it's a multi-million dollar company. It's in many of the nation's largest retailers and in seven countries. Her number one tip for wannabe business owners, write it down, use support networks and social media groups, gather a team you trust, and ask a lot of questions. As adults, we kind of quit asking questions, but Kids haven't tried things, and they have great questions, and listen, and, and explore those ideas with them. Her future mission is to create, or as she says, zollify, more products. It really is not only a, a successful company in my eyes, but also a company doing good. Alina's nonprofit, A Million Smiles, gives free candy to schools. Ten percent of all her sales go to support oral health education. And that's your Health Watch. I'm Connie Fellman, Local 3 News.